Welcome to this 12 minute yin yoga routine. In this video, we'll practice shoelace pose combined with eagle arms so you can focus on your hips and shoulders at the same time. We'll be holding these poses for about three to four minutes on each side. Begin by coming into half shoelace, placing your right foot over beside your left hip, keeping your left leg long for now. You can sit on a cushion or a yoga block here to make this pose a little bit more accessible. If you want to go deeper into your hips, now you can bend your left leg so your left foot is beside your right hip. If you're here in full shoelace, make sure that you can feel both of your seat bones pressing against whatever you're sitting on. Don't be afraid to widen out your feet to give yourself more space to do that. Straighten your spine, unclench your jaw, relax your shoulders. From here, we'll incorporate eagle arms. Stretch your left arm out straight in front of you, pushing it as far away as you can. Then bring your right arm in underneath. The first option here is to hold opposite shoulders. The second option is to take a twist into your arms so you can have your palms facing each other. Either option is fine here. This pose will meet you wherever you are. If you want to go a little bit deeper, you can start to gently lift your elbows up. Maybe drop your chin towards the floor. Maintaining some activity in this pose here. So even though your arms are twisted, Imagine you're trying to get your left arm back to the left and your right arm back to the right. So you'll feel a little bit of opposition within your arms. Bring your awareness to your jaw. If it's tight, loosen it up. Bring your awareness to your shoulders. If they're tense, Try to relax them. Bring your awareness to your spine. Maybe you can straighten it a little bit more. Bring your awareness to your hips. If they're holding on to something, let it go now. You can start to slowly unravel your arms. Then interlock your fingers. Have your palms facing away from you. Push your palms away as you drop your head. And take a few breaths here to open up your back and your shoulders again. Drop your right arm back behind you and place your left arm to the outside of your top knee. Coming into a gentle twist here.
coming back to center now, you can start to undo your legs. Let out a big sigh here if you need to. And now do whatever you need to do to release. Maybe wiggling your toes, circling your ankles. Now lean far back on your hands so you can open up your shoulders. Take a bend into your knees and just drop your knees from side to side slowly, releasing any tension from your hips. We'll repeat on the opposite side, coming back into half shoelace, this time bringing the left foot beside the right hip. Settling into this side of the pose. If your body is inviting you to go deeper, you can now bend your right leg as well. Both seat bones find the mat. Each inhale straightens the spine, each exhale releases tension from the jaw, from the shoulders, from the spine and from the hips. Coming into eagle arms now, right arm stretches far in front of you, left arm swings underneath, hold opposite shoulders or take a twist into your arms. If your body invites you to do so, you can gently start to lift your elbows, maybe bow your head. Each inhale straightens your spine. Each exhale sends a wave of relaxation from the crown of your head to the tips of your toes. Start to unravel your arms now, trying to touch your elbows back behind you, open up your chest, interlock your fingers and press your palms away from you, bow your head and breathe. Exhale to come back to center, dropping your right arm behind your back, bringing your left arm to the outside of your top leg. Inhale to lengthen, exhale to twist from bottom to top of the spine. Coming 
Come back to center when you're ready. Undo those legs. Lean far back on your hands so you can open your shoulders and find some windshield wipers to get rid of any last residue of tension from your hips. If it feels good for you, you can start to incorporate some neck stretches here. When your knees are dropped to the right, bring your left ear over your left shoulder. And when your knees are dropped to the left, bring your right ear over your right shoulder. Maybe drop your head back to open up the front of your neck. Drop your head to the front to open up the back of your neck. And just gently roll your head here in whatever way feels good to do so. Of course, you can stay on your mat for a little bit longer, but if you are ready to come back, you can take a seat on your mat, close or relax your eyes, and take a few quiet breaths here, just observing how you feel after this practice. With an exhale, slowly open your eyes if you're ready to do so. Thank you so much for joining me for this practice. I hope you found it helpful. If you did, please do me a favor and leave this video a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe so we can practice again in the future.